All right, welcome to SC Custom Designs. It's been a long time. I think it's January 18th, and I'm finally doing my first or second video of the year. Um, I've had a lot of projects going on. One of the projects was putting up an, uh, a ceiling and patching another. But I'm going to show you what really helped me with that project. LED lights, my friends. If you don't have any, I highly recommend that you get them. So not only is it helping me out in my shop, oh, sorry, on the, on the project for the windows, uh, this unit here, and look up the, the video. I did a video on this guy. Um, I had an LED light, uh, shop light, okay? Like uh, this, for example. This is not an LED shop light, but uh, I had it hanging here. And I put this unit up here and another one over there and I had it aiming like down in this direction uh, my jet bandsaws on wheels so I can move them around well essentially all I really need to do is move them this way um, and now I'm pleased to, to tell you that oops I'm sorry about that all right folks pleased to tell you that I'm gonna be able to just turn that around and get um, Hopefully, I'm going to turn my heater off so you can hear me better. <clears throat> All right. It's actually good for video, too. <laughs> so um, this is some of the things I was doing when I hung up this simple light here in a, a, a more complex light. Um, I had a problem, a situation where I had this guy. It, it, uh, I had to fit him into a triangle area. And uh, actually, I just had one of my subscribers... Oh, by the way, welcome again to SC Custom Designs. We are in the wood shop, and uh, we're going to talk about um, this product here that I got. Some Christmas gifts and something I got from Rockler. But uh, I had a subscriber. Thank you, new subscribers, by the way. We'd love to see you. Uh, we'd love to hear your comments. Uh, some comments are uh, need, to, need to calm down a little bit. I don't understand why people are so angry and uh, like to pick apart the littlest things but maybe that's the price of uh, getting a lot of subscribers so i like the thumbs up i like the thumbs down if it's the thumbs down let me know why but be nice about it there's no reason why not to be all right get that out of the way but uh so thank you again um so that one subscriber a, a subscriber said can you please um do a video i'll be right back um or or tell me how to use this unit here which is you know I'm not going to remember the name of it but it's an adjustable unit where you can replicate angles right and he wanted me to, to I think it was Liam not sure uh, he wanted me to uh, show do a video on cutting out bricks and stuff like that I'm not going to reinvent the wheel Liam there's no point to do that um, I'm not a mason, so you know, one day I may be doing that type of thing because I do all types of things. I'm a QA software guy in the daytime and nights and weekends. We are SE Custom Designs. And so rather than reinvent the wheel, I'm going to put a, a link in your just below your comment and you can go directly to the site. You'll see a lovely demo on how to uh, use this. So I, I quite literally used it for the very first time. Um, I got it in 20, I want to say 17. In Christmas three years later I finally used it for my uh, bedroom to meet that triangle shape all right so that being said um, just know that I can be a little bit chatty um, sometimes you're gonna see a demo of something or what I'm working on um, and, and uh, sometimes you'll just hear me talk a lot and hopefully you're okay with that um, it all depends on what, what the series is all about so today we're going to talk about this unit from Garrett Wade. Garrett Wade uh, provides really nice tools and gadgets um, that no doubt you folks are ordering. And I, I'm not a salesman for Garrett Wade or anything you see in my wood shop. I just uh, I use them. And I'm glad that I'm sure they're glad I'm buying those things and talking about their product. But this is a 33 piece drill and driver set. Okay, and what I did, just let me know if you want this and I'll send it to you, okay? I just threw together a document that's going to 
talk about all the items inside of that box, okay? And so, and I have links in the document that you can click on um, if I thought it was necessary so you can get a little bit more information. But we're going to go ahead and dig into this. I'm going to make sure you can see what I'm saying. Um, There's a little bit of a different configuration. I believe you can. All right. So, uh, uh, before we do that, hey, let me just show you. So, it was Christmas time, and the folks were, were asking me what I like, and I said I like the bandy clamps. Um, bandy clamps are great. So, I got four of these. These are medium size, and they're great for holding on that trim. So, it's, it's, got, it's very, very strong, um, and it's going to take that trim and push it in. And so, now I have more of them. I have four more of them. And so, my bandy clamps are hanging up over here. I realized that I'm going to have to, um, and I did get more of those posts and, and hooks to put on the um, the pegboard, and also I got uh, this. I got this uh, Merle, the adjustable table corner clamp. All right, so I got that. That's going to come in handy for those. Uh, square jobs, rectangle jobs, uh, odd jobs that you, you got to just clamp things. So um, that was very nice. Very nice. So we're, we won't be opening that. I don't have a reason. I also got this. I'm sure you'll recognize this guy here. So I got this book for, for Christmas as well. And uh, so you may recognize him from Parks and Recs. Didn't know he was a carpenter and liked to work with wood. And he's got a dog. I have a cat and a visitor dog that comes to the shop. So that was that. And I also got the Oregon Trail. Looking forward to reading through that. So that's my Christmas. All right, so let's just move stuff out of the way. Oh, I also wanted to share a quick tip with you. Like I said, we talk about a lot of things. When, when I got a job to do and I have to move a lot of clamps, what I do is I clamp my clamps. Now, that may seem really silly. Like, well, I, of course I knew that, Steve. Well, I didn't even think about it until a little while ago, and often my subscribers will say, thank you very much. Uh, I didn't really think about that. So, you know, if you're, you got all these clamps, you got to move them upstairs or on the site, go ahead and just clamp your clamps. So that was a little bit of a tip of the day. All right, so there you go. There's that. So let's go ahead and dig into this, this box from, um, from Garrett Wade. All right, let's see here. We'll use this. Actually, we can use this, this 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 little knife here. Let's see where it is. So I also got these two other things. I'm going to come over here so you can uh, get a better look at it. Oh, you're not really. Uh, so this is Garrett Wade. This is a little uh, piece, a little pen that has all different kinds of bits inside of it, a star shape. Uh, it has, I'm not going to take it out because it's hard to get them all back in again, but there's a lot of them in there. And your typical uh, bits that you need. Uh, so that was nice from, from Garrett Wade. So I got that, and I got this free knife, pocket knife from Garrett Wade. All right, so that, that was nice to have. All right, now let's use it. If I can get it open here. Um, so open up this box here. You watch, I probably won't be able to get it open. I've never been good at opening these. All right. All right, there we go. So let's make sure you can see what I'm saying. Let's open it up. I decided to make this purchase. And you're going to see why. Because um, you're going to have... Um, all your bits in one place. Okay. So let's get this guy out of here. Drop down there. All right. So I already opened this up when I got it uh, last week because I wanted to make sure everything was, was okay with it. And the very first thing that happened um, was that these yellow clamps fell right off. So I'll let 
Garrett Wade know that. We need to rethink that. So let's just do this. Get out of here quick. All right. Let's turn it this way. And, uh, here they are. Where's the unit? So these clamps here fell right off. I thought that was not wise. Whoever designed that needs to think about how to design things. All right. So you want to save a dime and make it cheaper. Well, that doesn't make the product look that good. So there you go, my friends. Um, we'll break all this down and uh, we'll talk about it. And we have two drawers that pull out like this. All right, and we got pieces that fell out here. There you go. So that's that one. So I'm gonna have to find out where these guys go. We'll just randomly place them in here for now. It's not the end of the world. Just make sure that they're not gonna get lost or this type of thing. So you can imagine 333 uh, pieces here. You're probably going to find the size. You know, that some of it is redundant, okay? So you're going to have uh, various various sizes. So that's that one. Okay, that slides in. And you got this one. I'm going to bring the camera over a little bit closer. Oh, looks like that guy fell out. Where did he come from? He came from here, 15, 30 seconds. And the first thing you'll notice is they're made out of different metals. And you have different drill bits for different purposes. So you got 1 16th all the way down here. Wow. So uh, looks like they provided several of those. Wow. So there you go. All right. Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, bring the, the camera over so you can see it a little bit closer. So, in theory, if these clamps work, then I try to put them back on again, and they just wouldn't go back on. So I'm going to have to figure out what to do. So you can lift it this way and or this way, and you can tuck it down wherever you have to. All right, so. All right, let's bring over the camera a little bit closer so you can have an idea of what we're what we have here. All right, sorry if you guys guys watching on big TVs. Uh, I've heard more than once. Steve, please stop shaking. You're giving me all kinds of grief over here. All right, so 333 piece drill and driver set. Okay, here in a box with two drawers, okay, like you just saw. Um, no less than 200 drill bits, long and short masonry, um, short spade, titanium twist, black oxide twist, and brad point bits, plus 100 hex shank drivers of every description, a drill sizer, I'm going to need that. Uh, multiple nail sets, drill stop collars, countersink, and a dozen fractional socket drivers. So Workman absolutely loved this set and praised its completeness and security. At this low price, about 45 cents each, you'll always have just the right bit and size and hand. And of course, it comes with the Garrett Way guarantee. All right, and this is made in, in, in uh, China. And so there you go. There's a 90-day money-back guarantee, free returns. They actually give you labels uh, so that if you're not happy... Now, I'm not going to send this thing back just because um, these guys fell off. I, I ain't going to bring it to their attention, though. I'm sure they want to know. Probably not the first time they're hearing about it. So, again, let's go through this real quick. I'm not going to read all this. Like I said, uh, feel free to, uh, to ask me, and I'll send you this document that I made. So short, you have long and short masonry, long and short spade, a titanium twist, black oxide twist, 
All right, brad point bits, 100 hex shank drivers. There's your drill sizer, multiple nail set, drill stop collar, countersink, fractional socket drivers, okay? So there you go. Now that we're a little bit closer, let's have a look. Let's pull the bottom one open here. How beautiful is this? Let's try to come in a little bit close. All right, look at that. I'm not even sure if that's coming in. Let's go ahead and bring the LED light down a little bit closer. All right, there you go. Isn't that beautiful? So now, I mean, you know how you know how it works. You have these things here. I got bits and pieces in there. I've got bits and pieces. By the way, I did clean up my wood shop. Um, I've had a cleaner, but at least it's not a atrocious anymore you know you've got these pieces all over the place you got them in your toolboxes and you know I'm gonna have them in here as well in that drawer there notice all my things uh, units are on wheels because that's the way to, do, to go about that um, you've got them everywhere now I have them all in one place and the beauty of this they'll put the second drawer now again the beauty of this is that when you break it you can replace it and put it right back right and again you're going to have uh, redundancy for example if we come down here and have a little bit close okay so this guy here is 516 516 okay I'm not going to pretend to know what all the verbiage is here when they say fo <laughs> oh pH 0 pH 11 pH H1 pH H1 pH H2 okay so I did notice that they, they were floating all over the place when I when I opened this up. So I have to figure out where that guy went. But there you go. Just really, really impressive. Let me tell you. So all the way from one half inch um, down to 364. 364. Looks like they give you one, two, three of them. I'll probably break all of them. Four of them. One, two, three, four, five, perhaps. So there you go. Isn't that awesome? Okay. It's hard to do things with one hand. There we go. Now we're going to open up the top. Look at that, my friends. Okay, there's, uh, you'll figure out what size you're working with there. All right, and uh, I purposely read at the beginning um, what they were so that I didn't have to stop and explain along the journey. But let me tell you, I'll tell you what, and I've got these in various places, and then I'll, I'll lose one of them, and really the discipline about all this is putting them back where they came from. I don't know about you, but often I don't, I just don't do that. Now I'd like to see some bigger than this, for example. Um, I bought a two and a half inch for something that I needed. And uh, at, at any rate, so there you go. I hope you enjoyed that um, unboxing of this unit here. Again, this is from Garrett Wade. All right, 333 piece set. And um, it, 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 it was on sale and they'll, go, they'll put it on sale throughout the year. Uh, for a hundred and three dollars they, they throw in this knife here Let's See if we get a better look at that Isn't that nice Little pocket knife and they threw in this driver set here Very very nice, so they have very very small star um, Regular screwdriver and Phillips screwdriver, so that came with it as well, so all right, uh, thanks for coming into my shop. Hopefully you enjoyed this. Uh, please consider subscribing to our channel. Um, it's still, it's way early in the year. Again, this is my, I think it's my second video. I'm, uh, who knows if I did another one. But um, I, I just am getting back to uh, off my projects from the house. I had to do a lot of things in the house. And uh, I have to make the Christmas presents for 
2018. So I got you know, I just didn't have time this year. All right, so thanks for coming to my shop. Um, my shop is is big enough. Um, again, if you see that I don't have a guard on that, don't beat me up over it. I'll put the guard back on. We try to be as safe as we possibly can. Um, and you know, you got to work within your own comfort zone. So at any rate, um, we got some things we're going to be doing. We got this hold down set from Rockler. You might think that I'm sponsored by Rockler. Actually, I'm, I'm trying to get sponsored from Rockler. I just need to get my subscription list, uh, YouTube subscription list, up to a thousand, and then uh, the possibilities will be there. They assured me that it'll be something they can do. So, all right. So here we go. Lots of fun things. Um, I got lots of tools for various uh, types of projects. Okay. Lots of different things. I've done very intricate uh, type. Okay, that's just having a fun time falling there. Uh, again, here is the... Uh, we'll try not to blind you. <laughs> here is this LED unit. And uh, let me tell you, um, it's, it's going to be the new... Let's see here. I don't want to blind me either. I'm going to be able to raise this guy on the tripod. It's a, it's a, I believe it's a Husky. I did a, yeah, it's a Husky um, from Home Depot. And I'll be able to shine it right on my bandsaw. I'll tell you what, you cannot get enough light when you are working on, on your bandsaw, for example. So I'm going to have copious amounts of light. Just give me an idea. I'll turn this off. Um... There we go. Now, mind you, my camera does a great job. My Google phone. Um, and I have a lot of lights in my wood shop. Okay, whoops, that's the old one. Start turning the lights out. Look at that Google phone. Just kicks in. I got lights over in there. Here. I got all these overhead lights here. Then I have the, uh, the standard lights here, the, and I have different types of light that it's going to give you the different color that you need and shades of color, depending on what you're doing. Then we'll come over here to this side of the wood shop. Look, the guard's on. You can tell I got really beat up over that. Somebody said, I'm going to stop following you because you're not safe. And um, uh, again, you know, don't work with your guards off. If you're not comfortable with it I've been working with tools for a long time now so naturally I'm gonna have more of a comfort level than than others who maybe don't even uh, have this uh, these types of tools that being said next week we're gonna have uh, somebody coming into the shop and they're going they bought this um, Porter cable jointer here it is over here we'll be cleaning that guy off and he was very gracious to uh, be in one of my videos. And uh, the reason why I can let that guy go is because I got this as a gift. Um, this is a Jet 6 inch with a very generous bed um, jointer. This here weighs more than, I mean, if this thing weighs 20 pounds. The way they made this, amazing. This is Jet still makes these, but this guy goes back a while. Actually, one of one of uh, subscriber said, "Hey, I have that one," and they they said that they have the manual as well. I had to find out where to get the manual, so I got the manual. Um, somebody reproduces them, and you may recall. Look up the video, please. I made this unit here because it didn't have anything here. So I can have my dust collection. Trust me, when you're removing, uh, when you're jointing, it, it, there's a lot of chips that come out of there. So at any rate, that's why I can uh, go ahead and, um, I, you know, I like redundancy. Trust me when I when I say that. I like redundancy because you can set one unit up to do one thing and the other. But I really have been looking for this guy. This is where we'll end our video. I was really looking to, to get this... Uh, this set here so 
Once again, thanks for coming to the shop at SC Custom Designs. Leave your comments, your complaints, <laughs> suggestions. And uh, again, I'll go ahead and just let me know and I'll send you that document. Uh, it's going to have links for, you know, if, you, if you're not sure what something is. When it seemed obvious, I just let it go and I just left to the, the descriptions. All right. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Guys and gals coming to my shop again next week. We'll have another video. Uh, the guest visitor will come and pick up his uh, jointer. So thank you. Take care. God bless. Shalom Mukulam. Hello to everybody in Israel and all over the world. Uh, I lived all over the world as a kid. And I uh, got to meet some amazing folks from, from all over. So it's been a pleasure to travel. Russia, China. Um, never made it to Australia or New Zealand. Um, that or South Africa. As far, got as far as El Elamin, um, climbed the pyramids and all that. A lot of stuff I did as a kid. Uh, got to have a lot of fun all the way across Europe and so on and so forth. So, all right, I'll stop talking, guys. Take care. Come back now.